Hey guys, in this video I will be showing you how to fix the stuck on reading appliance issue on Mac. So let's try importing it first. I'm gonna double click it and as you can see it will be stuck on reading appliance. So I will close this and force quit VirtualBox. Now to fix this issue we will need to extract the files that are inside the .ovf file. And to do that, I will search for the terminal and I'm gonna double click it to open it. And from here, we will enter some commands to extract the .ovf file. So let's navigate to where this file is located. And mine is in the downloads folder. So I will do cd, which is the command to change directories, followed by tilde. And to get tilde, hold shift and click on the key underneath the escape key from the top left corner. Then I will do forward slash and write the folder name. In my case, it is in the downloads folder. So I will do downloads with a capital D. Click enter. And now we are inside the downloads folder. So let's do ls to list the files inside this folder. Hit enter. And this is the file that we want to extract. So this is the same file that is listed in here. And to extract this, I will do tar followed by dash xvf. And after that, I'm going to put the name of the file, which is Kali. Notice the K is capital. So I will do capital K, A, L, I. And I will hit the tab key on the keyboard. This will auto complete the name for me. As you can see, it auto completed the whole name with the slashes. And this is the command that will uncompress this file. I'm gonna hit enter. And let's give it some time to uncompress. And awesome, it is now finished. So let's go here and we can see that we now have two files with an .ovf extension. So we have this file and this file. Now look for the one with the shorter name, which is this one. So I'm gonna double click it. And awesome, now we can import Kali Linux normally without any issues. If you have faced any issues throughout this video, please ask in the Q&A section and I will help you over there. 